Thank you, Cannon, for that great introduction. I'm glad we became such good friends this year. I enjoyed being your teammate at the Wyndham Cup, Go East, and I'm excited to be your teammate again in a few weeks at the Junior President's Cup. And yes, if my Buckeyes meet your Crimson Tide at the National Championship this year, I think we all know who's going to win. <laughs> Rose, congratulations on an amazing year. Your accomplishments and all you've achieved is truly remarkable. I'd like to start by thanking Mr. Stephen Hamblin and the AJGA for this award and for all you do for golf. It is a true honor to put my name on the same list as some of the greatest players in the history of the game. Growing up, watching guys like Tiger Woods, Phil Mickelson, and Jordan Spieth dominate the PGA Tour was a big inspiration for me. And now to have my name on the same list as them as Rolex Junior Player of the Year is a dream come true. What the AJGA has done for me and thousands of other junior golfers is incredible. On behalf of all of us, thank you for giving us the opportunity com to compete at the highest level of junior, junior golf, earn college scholarships, and create friendships that will last forever. From getting the last spot in my first AJGA Junior All-Star event through the qualifier in 2016 and winning the tournament, to chipping in on the last hole at the Junior Players Championship this September to secure this award, every experience I've had with the AJGA has been a blessing. The game of golf is not just about how you perform in tournaments. It's about the learning experiences you have and the friendships you create. The AJGA is an organization that makes all of this possible. It is with 100% certainty that I can say there is no better organization than the AJGA. I would not be here tonight without the support of the AJGA's ACE grant program. For the past three years, the program has supported my dreams. My dad works in the golf industry and my mom is a police officer. They work incredibly hard to support my goals, but as all of us know, golf quickly gets expensive. The ACE grant has helped me travel and compete in many of the world's best junior events and ultimately has paved the way for this award. Thank you to all the donors who support this program. Without it, I'm not sure I would have been able to attend Ohio State on a scholarship next fall, and I definitely would not be standing here tonight. I'm beyond thankful for what the ACE grant program has done for me. Thank you also to the AJGA's main partners, TaylorMade, Adidas, and Rolex, for your outstanding support of the AJGA for the past several decades. Thank you to my friends at Titleist and FootJoy, Mr. Jim Ahern, Jason Sigler, Bubba Kroger, Paul Vizinko, and Aaron Luttrell for supporting me the past several years. To my friends and family, thank you so much for everything. Your love and support of my dreams is something I'm forever thankful for. Without you all, there's no way I would be the person or golfer that I am today. Mom and Dad, I love you guys more than you'll ever know. Words can't describe how appreciative I am of the sacrifices you've made for my golf career since I was little. I'm so blessed to have you two with me here tonight and also as I continue my dreams into the future. Thank you for all that you do. I'd also like to give a special thank you to the Tarkini family. Through competing in AJGA events, I became great friends with Jacob and his family who hosted me for a week in Arizona this spring when the weather wasn't good enough to play golf in Ohio. That week, I got in some good preparation for the Junior Invitational at Sage Valley where I finished second. If I hadn't performed as well as I did there, I definitely would not be standing here tonight. I would also like to give a big shout out and thank you to everyone in Northeast Ohio. The great tournaments I grew up playing near home as a little kid have prepared me well for the ones I play today. It means the world to me to be the first Rolex Junior Player of the Year from Ohio, and I hope to see more Ohioans win this award in the future. Most importantly, I want to thank God and give him all the glory because without him, I would not be the person or golfer that I am today. The last few years have been full of ups and downs, but through it all, God has been with me every step of the way. I knew this through Romans chapter 8, verse 28, which states, we know that in all things, God works for the good of those who love him, those who are called according to his purpose. This verse inspired my attitude all year. It allowed me to know that whatever happened on the course or in my life, it was ultimately for my good. Knowing this, it was much easier for me to forget the bad rounds or bad days and use them as motivation to, to get better. Without the times of struggle, I would not be where I am today. To my fellow competitors, congratulations on being here tonight. I wish you all the best of luck as we head into these demanding, exciting four days of golf at a great venue. I challenge you all to know that whatever happens this week is for your own good and can ultimately help you become a better player and a better person. Thank you all, God bless, and have a great week. Thank you.